Music flows like a river from a Warren teen's fingertips, but hitting the right notes hasn't always been easy for Darius Simmons. I had a chance to catch up with Darius, whose perseverance to overcome adversity is helping him foster his gift of music. Driven by ambition, one of the keys to this 15-year-old's musical talent is his determination. I like piano music because it gives me, it's actually, it's like a challenge. A challenge Darius Simmons tackled head on a year ago, teaching himself how to hit all the right notes with only four fingers. Learn it from what I hear and then I just play it to the best of my ability of what I hear from the music. It was hard. I mean, when, when I first started out playing, getting my hand placement. That was the hard part, and that's the part I really had to sit down and practice sometimes all day. Life hasn't been easy for the Warren G. Harding freshman. He was born without six fingers and the bones below both knees. He wears prosthetics on his legs. But even as a third grader, his family discovered his gift, striking a chord on the piano at church. I was surprised. He's his grandpa got him started from church. He challenged him and he accepted the challenge. Setting the tone for what Darius hopes is a career as a musician, spreading hope in these keystrokes. I think that's inspiring to people. And it's inspiring to me too because at first I didn't think I was ever gonna learn how to play, play the piano. That's what um, can give people the drive and inspiration to actually set their mind to something and do something. And that's a melody that resonates across the board. Wow, absolutely incredible. And I, I understand that this isn't the only instrument that Darius plays. He plays with the trombone in both concert and jazz band. Exactly, it's wow. amazing. He's such a talented musician. And the song that we heard Darius play is one of his favorites. It's called River Flows in You by the Korean artist Yurama. Wow. And he really practiced it all year long. He really committed himself to learning how to play that song. And boy, did he <laughs> ever prove that he can really play that song in four different keys even. Unbelievable. Yes. Truly just, inspiring. Exactly. Yeah. Very touching. A Warren teen who hopes his music inspires others has inspired the very creator of the music he loves to perform. We have an exciting update to our original story on this young pianist who has overcome so much adversity to be able to play his heart out now at the world's most famous concert hall. Tucked away in Rome Township, inside a small, modest church, a Warren 15-year-old is warming up for the biggest stage of his life. That is awesome. I mean, it couldn't have happened to a better person. Born with only four fingers, Daria Simmons taught himself how to use every inch to hit the right keys. It's a talent that recently caught the attention of his favorite composer, the South Korean pianist, Iruma. That he played it so beautifully, and uh, yeah, I was really amazed. I feel really ashamed that I can't play well <laughs> with my 10 fingers. Uh, but yes, I mean, it's really incredible how he can create his own skills. Iruma saw our story that aired last month with Darius playing Iruma's song River Flows in You. The internationally renowned artist was so moved, he invited Darius to play with him side by side on the same piano bench at Carnegie Hall. I was real ecstatic. I couldn't believe that he wanted to play with me. I, I didn't think that he was going to want to play with me, but I'm, I'm ready for the performance. A performance Darius could only dream of as his first piano concert ever to showcase to the rest of the world anything is possible. And I'm also really happy to report that after our first segment aired, Geneva College donated a piano to Darius. Now we are going to be covering the concert tomorrow night. Be sure to tune in tomorrow at 6 in the evening for a preview and the complete report next Thursday. A dream come true for a Warren teenager who has beaten the odds to be able to master the piano. Videographer Mike Petrucci and I followed Daria Simmons to the Big Apple, where a star was born. 
a debut to remember. And to play with him, that's unreal. On the stage, 15-year-old Darius Simmons of Warren at one time didn't think he could grace. I feel absolutely just overwhelmed. Born without six fingers and the bones below both knees, the Warren G. Harding freshman taught himself how to make his four fingers dance across the keys and make his prosthetic legs press the right pedals. I want everybody to know that if you set your mind to something, you really can do it. I think that's inspiring to people. It's a tune that resonated with a popular South Korean composer and pianist, Iruma, when he saw our story on Darius last month performing his song. And all those determination and all that, I mean, it's just, I learned from you, really. Like, I, <laughs> I, I have so many things can be learned from you, really. So he invited Darius to join him on the same piano bench at Carnegie Hall. I really enjoy listening to <laughs> all your music. All your music really inspires me to keep playing the piano. Oh, that's great. Honestly. I mean, it's just amazing. How, how can you do that? Wow. I mean, all those jumps, you know, it's, oh, we, must, we must find it really difficult. It's not that difficult to me, honestly. You'd never know the two first met about an hour before the show, collaborating on the self-titled song Darius wrote. You can yeah, sing. That, that, that was not and prepared to play on stage. Practice is how you get to Carnegie Hall, which Darius did. Now that he made it here, Iruma was able to offer him some advice on how to further his career. Uh, I want him to, you know, keep on working on his new music. Music that's already making the hearts of New Yorkers sing. I thought Darius blew me out of the water. A young man leaving a lasting impression on the world stage that the sky's the limit when you believe. Wow, what an incredible experience. How do you top that? <laughs> exactly. It was Darius's first piano concert ever, but he said just having the chance to play with Iruma again would be enough. Yeah. Wow, incredible.